Oh, you know what I haven't done yet? I haven't explored all these islands up here. They're really foggy. Which is... kind of rude. I want to go here. No, I want to go to that tree. Oh no, I can't go to the tree. I have to do... The gotcha balls. <laughs> Nothing more important to me than balls. You know, that's probably why, or like, the main reason why I can't do, or don't want to do, steroids, because I love my balls. Like, who doesn't love big balls? I forget I'm, I'm putting this on YouTube and people are going to hear me talk about balls. You know, I should feel really sorry for, like, chopping this tree down. Can I land on this treasure box? <gasps> I can. I just kept moving because I wasn't sure I was going to be on the right... Part of this. <laughs> On like uh, the part of the chest that was walkable, I just like overcorrected, which honestly, story of my life. You know how many times I go and I play volleyball and I'm setting and someone's asking me to. Who's messaging me? Oh. I posted a story on Twitter. Uh, I mean, Instagram. About there being a tunnel under Hyrule Castle. And so I kind of spoiled that a little bit for some people who haven't gotten that far in the game. Is that it? We're done here. No Korok? Do I need to go here? No, I would like to... Go somewhere else. Let's... Go find Miss Fairy, wherever she is. You know, what I haven't done is is found a stable over here, and I know there is one. I just don't remember where. Wherever the... Oh, that's my horse. Woodland Stable is somewhere, and I don't remember where it is. Should I just follow the path down from here? Find out, or just look from the... What did I mark here? Oh, the shrine, probably. Let me just look from here and see if I see anything.
Anybody see any horse heads? What is it with these smatterings of like little islands here? Like just for fun? They're not even marked on... Or, or are they marked? You know why? It's because I changed... I changed map layers here. But they do exist. I don't need it. <sighs> that her? Yes, it is her. I feel like when I do this, when I drop and sail a little bit. I feel like I'm edging Link a little. No? Is that Kilton? I hope he's okay. Hey, you there, traveler. Do you have any business in this cave by any chance? I'm sorry to say, but right now it's... Big Brother! They definitely look related. It's no use, Colton. Please, it's impossible, it's absurd even, to try to turn yourself into a legendary creature. It's a Tori, no less. Absurd. We should be working on the monster collection with me instead of chasing a silly dream like that. Yeah! I will never give up, Kilton. I've always wanted to be a Satori. I will be a Satori. I do not care what it takes. All I need to do is get my fingers on a bubble gen that I'm sure to turn into a Satori. And the rumors are true! There's a creature in the cave called a bubble frog and it glows just like a Satori. Yeah, But I don't think it would be up so high on the wall or run about all nimbly bimbly like that. In that case, little brother, why not get someone help you catch a bubble frog? Yes, yes, do you remember all that treasure you collected? You could offer that in trade! What am I gonna do? Traveler, did you hear me and my brother talking? If I'm going to make my dream come true, I must get my fingers on a bubble gem. Yeah, but the bubble frog is so very nimbly and bimbly and hard to catch. You want to hear about my dream? Well, it's simple, really. I dream of becoming a Satori. You know, the creature of myth. Satori are legendary creatures that have been spotted all over Hyrule. Piercing eyes, bluish-white fur. Oh, how I've admired them since I was a wee Kotlin. And then I read these ancient texts and they told me how to transform myself. Transform me? Colton into a Satori! For it to work, I must find a bubble frog, a strange creature that loves dark caves and glows bluish white like a Satori. Then I have to collect a bubble gem, which is a bauble that bubble frogs drop when they're feeling weak. That's why I chased after the bubble frog lurking in the cave. I wanted to get my fingers on that gem, but who knew a bubble frog could gamble like that? Could gamble about like that? So nimbly bimbly. Yeah, I want to be a Satori. I will be a Satori. I'll do whatever it takes. I'm sorry, but that is my wish and my dream and my reason for doing such things. So if you get a hold of a bubble gem, please give it to me. I'll give you a treasure in trade, I swear. Yeah, these guys are gay rights for sure, 100%. That's a bubble gem. Colton, is it the real thing? That perfect shape, the faint blue glow? It's, it's a real bubble gem, real as can be. You did it! Now I can transform into a Satori just like the ones I adore! Mm, thank you so much. Please take this gifty in return. 
a Bokoblin mask. Kilton's handmade headgear. See, I collect all sorts of monsters treasures that monster parts and goods that make you look like a monster. The mask I gave you was made to look like a Bokoblin, so much so that even a Bokoblin would take you for one. By all means, do try it on, then you will see what it's like to have the body and heart of a Bokoblin. At last, at last, it's time has come to gobble down on the bubble gem! Cheers and bottoms. Up. Ah, my body is unchanging, but I do feel a strange sensation washing over me. It can only mean one thing. I'm on my way to becoming a Satori, and that means more. I need more of them. And I can't just gobble them up one at a time. No, that'll never work. I must collect lots and lots and eat them all at once. And to do that... Big Brother, I have decided to set out on a journey to collect bubble gems. I see. Well, it seems you made up your mind. That being the case, you have my complete support. I hope you collect as many bubble gems as you need. Big Brother, thank you. Thank you. Traveler. I'm grateful for your help, but I've decided to set out on a journey to collect bubble gems. Next time you get your fingers on one, please do give it to me. I'll trade you a gifty! And with that, I hope we meet again somewhere. I have like 20. Why do you have to like go somewhere, bro? Off he goes. I hope he's able to make his dream come true. I have to be on my way as well. I'll be making the journey to Terrytown and Akala. But dear traveler, thank you so much for helping my little brother. And though I hate to impose, I do hope that during your travels, you'll find time to assist him further. I will keep my ears wide open for news of my brother's whereabouts, so visit me in Terrytown if you need help finding him. And I'll be going now. Oh. Well, Kotlin. It is literally right there. It's like the easiest thing not hidden. I want to become frog. It reminds me of the character from Final Fantasy IX, Kina. I should have done that voice for them. Hot-footed, fireproof lizard. Oop, fire lizard. Hi, Seven. Hi, Jag. I somehow streamed for five hours yesterday. Today, I had to get up early for work. And so... I very much went back to sleep. Oh, you little bitch. Dog. Dog on. Dog wants belly rubs. Here you go. Eat from my hand. Or do I have to drop it for you? You sneeze? You play? Okay, eat. Good boy. I might just turn off Sidon because he just pops out of nowhere and freaks me out a little.
Can someone explain this to me? This is it? Strange. What's the news? Great fairy flees into flower bud. Her name is Bloony. That's like a weird name. I love Beatles sports bra. Wow, <laughs> well, he just gave me all this lore just from buying. Uh, wow. a critter. Hey. Yay. I should dress like... Ah. Oh. Like Beetle for... Mm -hmm. I was gonna say Christmas, but maybe Halloween. This is quite the outfit you've put together. Perhaps it could be a little more coordinated. Huh. A complete set. Okay, Nobo. Fire resistant clothes. Okay, you want me to wear clothes that match? Let me put on my wrestling outfit. Because this is the only full set I have. Oh, you have nothing to say about my... Mm, rude. Oh. It's finally here, the towing harness of my dreams. Took a while to save up points. Now that it's worth it, I can tow oh. to your heart's content. Oh. You wouldn't happy to be jealous oh. of my towing harness. Oh. I already have one. Should we tell the newspaper what happened here? No, no. Absolutely. We'll tell this whole awful story to the Lucky Clover and no one else. I don't know how we'll get word of this to them, though. The Gazette is in the Hebra region. Wow. Her name is Violin. That's pretty good. Very, very good. Good pun. How do I choose? How's the guy supposed to pick a path to Death Mountain? Take a trek up a mountain should be a red hot adventure. What's that? That's the fiery passion of my monologue. Catch your ear. Well, red hot is as red hot does, my friend. Oh. So a while back, Death Mountain was super active. We're talking full force, non-stop, red hot lava. But now the lava's all cooled down and hardened. It's even, uh, I hate to say it, made a new road that's easy to walk in. Ease, my friend, is the opposite of the red hot lifestyle. Now, the route going up to Death Mountain from Foothill Stable to the east, on the other hand, that's an old, dangerous road, absolutely crawling with <laughs> monsters. And that's what I call red hot, but 
My muscles aren't exactly ready to take the heat right now, so that makes my decision more complicated. Yeah, I haven't worked out in two weeks, and there's no way I'm working out today because I had blood drawn for labs today. Maybe I'll lift tomorrow. Hopefully I'm not egregiously weak. Where's the, where's the child? You're looking for stuff that fell from the sky too, mister? You don't know? Look up there. There's an island floating in the sky. You see it too? Sometimes when I'm looking at the sky, a big box falls down from that island. Ah, oh, there. Oh, look. A big box, you say? That's a big box, all right. And that means a sky person's got to be dropping them. I always knew there was a kingdom in the sky. I've always dreamed of going up there to play with all the sky animals. But I'm so little and I'm not allowed to go too far away. I want to hurry and be all grown up like you, mister. Then I can go up there. Yeah. With, uh... With what power? Well, I got a different kind of treasure. Can I open it from here? <laughs> of rock. Thanks, rock. I'm going to go into the cave and ascend, because I feel like that's the easiest way to get up to where that rock fell. Yeah, I was right. Holy shit. Holy shit. So many rocks! Like, what if I position myself just underneath that rock and it falls and mm, causes me to... Die. Wouldn't that be wonderful? Wouldn't that be grand? Oh, there's a shrine here, huh? And some ducklings. You notice how the game moves a lot slower when I'm zooming in? They must have done that intentionally. Fall rock. Bonk. I've done this already. Well, they want me... to go... And do stuff over here, which I'm not sure I'm ready to do quite yet. I know that Joshua wants me to do this. I, I have to go into the depths. And they said, like, the last person looked at over here, sort of? Probably makes the most sense for me to start from here. 
and go to the central abandoned mine unless I s unless I'm mistaken for what this quest wants me to do. Yeah, see, see, it faces this way, this way. I need to find another one. I think one is over here. Okay, I guess I'll keep following these statues. Link, climb. Link, climb. Link. Link. Link! Never mind. Oh, you see that? Oh, that's a thing I put there! I really thought it was a symbol of like, hey, you can open this, but no, it's like junk that I've put down. It's not like the statues, like, face... Uh, like, there's things that... Do not trust a bitch. Yeah, fuck you. From stone statue to stone statue, they really do form an unbroken chain. Overheard me! Did you take a look at this giant stone statue? I know it's dark and hard to see, but look, there's one over there too. And one over there too. And one over there too. But you're not gonna live long enough to see it, are you, Link? You die here. I like the voice, and it being, like... Oh shit. Stab him, will you? Okay. Thanks for the... The blade that I can't use. Wow. Long. Oh, I haven't done this Yiga clan Yiga business. Let's go say hi to them. In a friendly way. They gave me a spring, some sticks, a cart, some wheels, a light. This thing won't settle down. No control rig? Rigged. Alright, run into me, bitch. Give me your car. Too bad I can't take their- their pieces. My favorite part about the control stick is that, like, almost anything I make will work. Um... You know what? I just jumped into the spikes. Are there spikes all the way around here? Like, not one opening? Oh my god. They've really built a fortress out here, eh?
Well, this sucks. It's okay, I have a couple boxes. <laughs> I think a couple boxes won't fix. Climb up the boxes, Link. Link, climb. Thank you. Oh, yes. I mean, he's just spinning around in circles. It's not like this dude down here is actually going to cause me pain. Get fucked. Goodbye, plane. Safety first! Transportation constructed from Zonai devices is convenience, but uh, precaution must be followed. Familiarizing yourself with the following guidelines will reduce the two most common causes of fatalities. Keep your balance to avoid overturning the vehicle. If the vehicle is off balance, evacuate. Protect the driver from all attacks. Even a simple arrow can threaten their ability to steer. Slash. It's a box. Oops. I, I didn't want that to deploy. I don't know if I ate enough before my stream. I kind of just went with... Cereal and breakfast food. And did not have like a full rice meal. So we know how that's gonna go for me. This is why I have three rings of stamina. What? I've already taken their shit? Alright. Let's follow these dumb statues. I mean, what I could do... Is just... Take a car, and go for a ride. But I'm on foot. Have I not done her? No, I've done her. She has foliage everywhere. Oh my god, there's a light route all the way up there. Goodness gracious. Oh dear. <laughs> that was close.
You didn't protect me, Sidon, you fucking dumbass. Is it his fault or is it my fault? It's my fault. I'm also way underprepared. I have no more food. Because I used it all while I was doing my Elden Ring segment. I have so many pose. I've got pose. I've got pose in different area codes. Area codes. I've got pose. You're in my way, Sidon! Uh, let me get these pose, and then I'm gonna get distracted over on the other side there, eh? Oop, almost fell off. Oh my god, there's a lot of pose in this house. Which also reminds me, I need to go to that other spring. Just so I can reveal the other locations of those bargainer statues. I finally edited one of my videos that I took. By edit, I really mean just clipped out the dead time. Between points from um, this volleyball footage I took. It's all cliff, so it's probably not great for me to go directly up the cliffside. I might have to follow this branch to whatever is lit over there and see if there's a way around. I had some really good digs on Monday night. I got to play Libero, which I usually end up not playing because everybody else is not a setter or a middle, and that's what I usually end up playing at these open plays. I'm just a giver, or I should say, uh, I would rather play a position where I know th that we'll get decent play together yeah. instead of wasting my time, although I feel like I will actually end up wasting my time doing God damn it. A pin. Oh, that green is pretty far away. I'm getting further and further away from God's plan. Yeah.
Oh, is this the top? Yeah. Yeah, Jesus Christ. Oh, goodness. But did I not put anything on that? Okay, sis, damn. This looks like a, a, a refinery facility. Get sticked. <laughs> South Lomay Depths Labyrinth. Oh my god, I made it all the way over here? This was not my intent. To get this, to walk this far in the Gerudo? I've been Guru Got. What I need is a light route, though. Okay, well, I guess I'll take her off and go there. I don't really have any other choice, huh? What is this? I really thought it was a cave. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. They got me, gal. Where's my climbing gear? Look at Zelda, I mean Link pant. He's tired. Wow, I got trolled. All because I put Uh, uh, bright bloom down. I got trolled. I got trolled. I'm gonna have to take this jacket off. <gasps> oh my god, Link. You almost made it up. There's no overhang for me, too. This is incredibly rude.
Okay, so him popping out is really ruining my frame rate. So go away, Sidon. Like, you were cute for a couple hours and no longer. Uh, especially because you're not going to be, be married to me, which is the worst thing that's ever happened to me in the history of the Legend of Zelda. Is that where that is? You know what? No, this is much closer. Yeah. I will come back to you, person. Anakin Skywalker Light Root. I am Light Root. The Zen Garden Sand Circles, very much a theme in this game. Well, let's go help him out, I guess. Bong. Where are they? Okay, I've put a pin over there already. Hello, Leighton, Tony. How are you? Happy Thursday. Uh, are you here to help? Please, this is this misery. I'm covered in gloom. I need a sun lion. Sorry, can't help. You'd walk away from someone in need? But da da dum hmm. Some hero you are. So heartless, I feel my rage giving me strength. Prepare to die. Okay, clown. Oops. Maybe I'm the one who should be dead. <sighs> Anyways, I used your own arrows because uh, I'm very bad at fighting right now. You've been playing a lot of Animal Crossing. I have only been messing with this game. This game has me by the throat, 100%. Thanks for the seeds. 
It's just a sled. Well, let's see if their weird sled thing works. It works? Do I feel like killing Pokoblins? Maybe. What are you doing in Animal Crossing now? I stopped playing that game in... Basically... September of... 2020? Fishing? play for your loans. What you need is someone who has access to only one arrow comes out? Or is that because I hit it on the ground? You need someone who can play the stonk market for you. The turnip market. I don't have a uh, hacked switch to help. I am but a lonely streamer with an original switch that won't use his power for good. Oh, that was here. I won't use my power for good because I don't have the right setup. Where was I going? Gonna say hi to the Yiga. Over here. You have a museum right now? Yeah, I did a lot of work to at least do the dinosaur bones part. The fish filling out, I got exhausted pretty quick. So I gave up on that. And then like trying to fill out the whole art museum section, that feels like it's going to take decades. So I kind of just chose not, not to. Oh my god! Fucking lasered. Oh my horse. Oh, those lasers really scared me. <laughs> Oh, no more bow.
Where's the dude with the the seal? Oh, he's floating here. What's up, dude? Bye. Some of the huge roots growing from the ceiling have glowing cores. We've been using them as landmarks, but they have been, may have been an additional use for covering vitality lost to the gloom. The light appears to have a mysterious healing effect that feels like being back on the surface. Unfortunately, the small amount of light is very weak. We are investigating whether the effect can be strengthened. If this research goes well, it may even be the end of carrying Sun Alliance. <laughs> Like, just like the time that Animal Crossing came out was just a good time to just waste and not think of, of real life responsibilities. I should probably exchange my charges for a full battery, the crystallized ones. Okay, so that white, I mean the yellow and red one. Let me do the yellow one. I mean the the red one. You know, maybe they have a plane for me somewhere. Yeah, they do. Cool. Let's go. What is this? I think I've already been there. But like, this was hiding on the other side, I guess? The recharge time for the batteries? Feels like super aggressive to me. Oh, it was the labyrinth. And what route is this? Did it not say because it said something else? Am I on top of the labyrinth? I just noticed that the light roots are also five pointed, five sided. And look, no plants are grown here. Interesting. Sisu stone. Who are you calling Sisu?
please get control control it oh no why is it gonna disappear now now's not the time what gives Hi, I'd like a car, please. My vehicle is not here. Yeah, I had made... I didn't make... I had found a pre-built vehicle. I guess I'll just follow these statues. Getting gang banged. That's so unnecessary. to go towards the yellow. Oh, that's a big boy, huh? I've been killing all its little little babies. I wonder if killing it is going to leave it like allow it to drop something massive. Oh, he has stuff on his back. Ferox. It's like a high high knocks, but not. It has different music. Amazing. Hold up. It's like a turtle. Oh, I love the music. I don't love that. He eat. How can he eat? He eat. Oh, I love the strings. Bye, baby. Frock's Fang, a giant ore crunching Frock's Fang. Attach it to a weapon to moderately increase its attack or cook it. What a big cute boy! Frock's Fingernail. Oops. Well, 
Well, I, this is where Zelda's gonna just be. Oh, wow, look at this. Nice little deposit. So like the Frox is like a frog version of a Hinox. Cause it had that single eye, but it was also like, I'm turtle. There is so much. Over here. Yeah, I don't need you. And this is how I get incredibly distracted. Because there are just light roots that appear everywhere. Including one over here, which I didn't even mark. Are they going to eat it? That's what happens. On, dudes. Keep your arms to yourself. No, not my sledge. Oh, I threw the wrong thing. I will always stop to pick up bombs because God knows I waste my bombs like crazy. I'll leave them alone. probably won't ever use giant bright blooms until I have run out of my 300 standard size <laughs> bright blooms. See her? Oh my god, she's way down there. Why did I mark this? I 
I think we need purple. Rockets, time bombs, fans. No control stick. I have a love-hate relationship with rockets in this game. I need wood. Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck. Why am I hot? Why is it cold over here? Why am I hot? Make it go out, please. Oh shit. Bonk. Oh, 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 oh no. Oh no. Abandoned Karakara Mine. Nineteen is such a weird number. Thirty? Oh, Can't have thirty. Can't have twenty. I'll just do ten. Cause I don't I, I want whole numbers. Like, numbers divisible by 10. Yep. 
Miner's mask? Yes! I don't know what I should put on the bodysuit. Well, that, that works pretty good for now. Yell at me, because I'm not authorized to be here yet. You, sir, you suck. Please come back later. Whoa, who put that up there? Now I have weird number of charges? How dare they? Ooh, what is this? Large charge. I had like eight. Thank you. <laughs> Remember how I was following those statues? And now I'm just not? Buy stone talus sledge.
Oh, shit. Um, actually... I missed. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Link. Link! Link! This was all a mistake! What is down here? I don't want to pee down here. Oh my god. That's a no for me, dog. Bitch, a Lionel? Oh my god, she hit me! Oh my god, she's coming for me. I'm just trying to go over to the green thing. Oh my god! Thanks for the arrows. I just gotta keep on moving. I ah! Um. Excuse me? Dude got hands. I'm not going that direction I came. I am all so sorry. Jesus Christ. One balloon incident turns me into getting sniped twice by a Lionel who's shooting arrows into the sky. Disgusting. I look like a mountain goat. Oh. 
You know, one of these days I'll go and get, you know, I'll fix the Master Sword or whatever. I don't think today is one of those days. Very troll treat. Dude, I'm almost at like the limit. Yeah, no, I have to go over here. It's just a sea of gloom. Oh my god. Is that other frocks? <laughs> I'm gonna hit the ground soon, yep. Damn, I gotta climb to get up there. This is, I shouldn't even be able to ascend right there, like, barely. I'm sorry, how am I able to do this? Uh, 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 Link, you're dead. Oh, nice! Even better! There's just so much out here, you guys. Oh my god.
Crocs? Are you gonna spit on me up here? Like, I don't feel like fighting you right now. Bitch! You see how that bitch leaps? I wanna see it leap again. You not see me? I'm above you. And it's gone. Not that one. Um... Okay, I don't know where that landed, but... We're not going there anyway. Remember how we were supposed to follow those statues? I've completely lost sight of that. I didn't find the great fairy thing because I went the wrong direction. I'm supposed to do this whole like... Gazette Lucky Clover thing that I've ignored since the second time I played this game once I got off the... Great Sky Island. I think I'm just going to teleport somewhere to, like, a location that I'd sort of recognize, maybe. Or should I just go to the central mine? I mean, I could come in from above. I'm gonna come in from above. I'm gonna go through the, the chasm that I didn't go in yet. On the Great Plateau. There's also people on the Great Plateau Yiga Clan that I have not dealt with yet at the old like wood keeper's house where I wasn't quite prepared to deal with them at the time. I haven't done that either, huh?
See that red hole? That's the goal. Oh, there's a shrine over here. I didn't know there were any shrines on the plateau. Such a narrow hole, huh? Kind of trippy. Very trippy. I don't know how I feel about that music that just played. Skinty hole. Did someone say a narrow hole? <laughs> you indeed heard correctly. What the fuck was that? Why does it sound like things are falling? Why do I have two arms? Oops. Hi Morty. Thank you for lurking. Hands. Holding hands. Slapped. Get slapped. S -s Slap. Stop wasting my battery. So, I've been told that... Um, in order to unlock something secret in this game... We have to do the following. You've been lurking the whole time? Well, I just gave this guy an anima. Oh, the animosity. Oh wow, they were actually taking me for a ride. If you want to go and take a ride with me... Oh, why must I live with you? Hi! Where are we going? Very extended. Do not leave. Do not come. There's no way. <laughs> this game is... incredibly creative. You can do it, you imagine it, you can do it, and it works. <laughs> um, that is not... Uh, something that I came up with myself. Uh, that is something that I saw one of my, like, favorite streamers do, and I was just like, uh, 
I can't not do this. You fucker. Get off my cock. I was just upset that I didn't come up with that myself. Like, super sad that I'm like, God. Someone else is more of a genius than I. I'm, I'm, I'm really stuck on this little light thing that I put here, huh? Snap. Oops. Uh, I guess I need a new arm. I've been on these rails before, but it's still just fun. Oh, never mind. I never figured out what I'm supposed to do here. Oh my god. He's too far up. He has a fat cock. It's too big, it won't fit. <gasps> like, I've already talked to this Poe. And it's gonna give me a hint about where Zelda is. I'm trapped under the water behind the stone gate. Of the Great Plateau. And yeah, I won't save her. <laughs> I haven't gotten that light route. Really? I find that hard to believe that I did not get that. Oh, I did. The plants just did not spawn. Anyways, this is where I started that whole quest. <laughs> um, and like... Got distracted for a whole like... 25 hours. I wish there was a way for me to see which directions they were pointing this whole time instead of just me aimlessly following. Unless I'm absolutely in the wrong place. I know there is this whole thing that I got to. Maybe I should check this out. Oops. Um. 
I don't think I've gone in here. Oh my god, it's up here. Okay. Let me find a way to get there. I didn't realize how elevated it was. There's some frogs up here. Oh, you still hit me? Rude. This is it? That's all I came here for? Everybody needs a long sword. A spear on the end of a sword. Still don't understand this. That's literally the central area. Is there like a backside I didn't know about? No, I've already done all of that. Or do I need to go higher in it? Maybe I'll try going higher. Go, you can't get no higher than this. You know, just in case it does break again, I'm gonna try something. I actually don't know how it's supposed to be built. And it's probably not supposed to be built like this.
Guess what, guys? It does not steer. Bye. I don't really remember this side of the abandoned mine. Oh, never mind, I do. I've been here. I don't know if I've been above it. Oh my god, there's this thing up here the whole time?! I don't know how I feel about these people. Did you pass the interview too? He obviously did. Why else would he come strolling up into a place like this? Why did I even bring it up? Forget it, it's not important. What's important is that I'm gonna beat your ass. He claims that the stone statue should be able to grant us an ancient power. That's right. Nothing less than one of the fabled constructs. It reads, this ability will allow you to commit any structure you create to memory. Any object committed to memory can be instantly reproduced. Just think of it. The Yiga... Uh, Oh, they didn't come kill me yet? I didn't think we'd see anybody else down here. Though I imagine you could say the same to us, huh? Um, you're here to investigate us too, you know? Since you took the Yiga, I mean, the survey team interview? Because we definitely took that interview too, and that's why we're here. <laughs> oh, look at this! Our latest discovery nearly knocked us off our feet. We found this weird device with these strange green letters on it and this strange statue. I think one of those things is a construct, but it's all conjecture. <sighs> In fact, I think we're in a bit of a panic here. If we don't figure out how this thing works, we're going to be in big trouble. Oh, there's no construct here? Yeah, I can't believe I never went up. I just saw the Poe and left it alone and decided, oh yeah, that's that. I don't have to do anything else. Turns out, nope. There's a whole dude inside here. Just waiting for me to press their button while a whole bunch of Yiga boys look at me and wonder, hey, is he gonna touch this thing or not? They're really stairs to nowhere, aren't they? I feel like I'm in Final Fantasy 7. Just running up that hill. The shirt? Nope. Not the shirt. I finally get a teleport point. Teleport point. Authorizer verified. It's moving! Conferring auto build to authorizer now. Please utilize it as you explore and excavate the depths for Zonite. I finally got the auto build mechanic, even though I've been here so long ago. Instantly recreate Ultra Hand projects using nearby items and Zonite. Did I just... See what I thought I saw? Did that thing just give you the power we've been researching? That's incredible! Could you give us a demonstration? Let's see what the text has to say. Hold on. Um, This ability will allow you to commit any structure you create to memory. Any object committed to memory can be instantly oh. reproduced. I know what just to use it on. As luck would have it, both of our vehicles just broke. We've been struggling to put them back together again. Oh. The one on the round pedestal lost a wheel. Uh. 
Um, and the one on the square pass the pedestal has fallen to pieces. But I think if you put the wheel back onto the first one, you should be able to use your power to repair the second one <laughs> in no time flat. So come on, let's see it in action. You can start by fixing it incorrectly. How did I do? <laughs> well, look at that. The wheel's back right on there snug as a bug. Now time for the main event. Use that new power of yours and fix it up lickety split. Things you build are stored in its history and can be easily created from there. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Super spring. Flamethrower balloon. Beam spinner. Beam turret. Instant scaffold. Monocycle. Lift off glider. Those are the schematics I got from the Yiga folks. It's gonna cost me 15. What if I don't have Zonite? It's like I'm seeing double, built in less than no time flat to. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Thank you, Ancient Power. The text were right after all. I'll say that power is incredible. Oh, Master! Oh, look at that. The legends were true. Master Koga, where's your daddy? Great work, both of you! You too, stranger. Credit where credit is due. Yes, credit where credit is. If there's one foe I'll never forget, it's the man who cast me from my Gerudo desert hideout into these very depths. It was you! Now I live for vengeance, both upon that no-good Zelda and upon my sworn enemy! That means you, Link. We meet again at last, and don't try to tell me you've forgotten me. We are bound by fate, you and I. Hear my name and tremble in fear? I am the leader of the Yiga clan. The strong, the depths defying from the ashes rising. Master Koga. <laughs> Let me hear his music. I saw it all. The moment I saw you obtain the ancient power we've sought for so long, the highlight of all the musty old texts we found in this land. It remembers objects you've assembled and can instantly reproduce them, a long lost ability from distant past. So, you! You! You're cheating! Here we are working ourselves to the bone to build things by hand, and you could just whip them up in an instant, and that's not fair! You know who could have used that power? The one we worship and revere, the Magnificent One. If we offered it to him, he would have crushed you and Zelda both. But you just walked right up and snatched it away. Now I'm gonna snatch it back! Oh. Um, we're, we're playing battleships? Excuse me? I wasn't thinking I was going to get myself involved in a battle, uh, but he has, he does have great music. What can I build? Beam turret. Here, thanks for your car, friend. Uh, sorry, I don't know how to drive your car, Master Koga. Oh my god. What the fuck is going on here?
I need a new weapon, please. How about this for now? Oh no, I need... Oh shit. I'm under his car. I need help. Oh shit, he's upside down. Ah, I'll burn him a little bit. What did he build? Like... <laughs> I'm sorry. You know, steering is not easy. Ho, ho, ho. Is he up there now? Oh no, he's just floating. Oh god, oh shit, oh shit! <laughs> he put rockets on his thing! <laughs> Let me go behind. Link, you can do it, Link. Get on his, sh his boat. Pesky little pest. Why don't you stand still and let me squish you? I already did that once. <laughs> well, fine. I suppose I can let you off easy for day today. You think you're so smart, but I've already found a whole bunch of ruins down here. I saw your little trick. You used your right hand to get that construct going. I'll grab that power for myself and you can check. And you cheated me out. Oh, well, I'll grab that power you cheated me out of for myself off at the southwestern abandoned mine. Then the Magnificent One and I will guide this world to its miserable end, and there's nothing you can do to stop us. He built himself a plane. On a cart. Don't follow me. Does he hit the rocks? Nope. Congrats. He avoided all of that. Yeah, I have enough for two batteries, excuse me. Thank you for repelling the trespassers. I hope you will pardon me for listening in on your conversation. That mind mentioned an abandoned mine to the southwest. I suspect that he's referring to the former Gerudo mine. That place flourished with activity long ago like this one, or was constantly refined, unearthed. There are statues that point the way to the abandoned Gerudo mine. Follow them to reach that destination. That's where I was accidentally ending up. One more thing before you set out. There is something I would like you to have. Please speak with my associate as soon as possible. Thank you for driving out the trespassers. I no longer need to hide. It is another reason that you've come. This is a schema stone. These slabs depict schematics of things such as Zonai vehicles. So I have Yiga schematics, and I have Zonai schematics. Mm -hmm. 
I am grateful to you. It was necessary to flee to avoid detection. Now I'm at liberty to trade. Alright, I think it's time to speak with... Oh, wait. I have all these other mines that I need to go collect things from? Okay. Karakara, Hateno, Lurlin, I'll start here. Collect those and then talk to Joshua about my discovery because Girl knows that I kept getting lost. Where's Bestie that's gonna give me a schematic? An eye beam. Yeah, now I ha I need to gather stones to use auto build. On to the next. I walked into a stick. I got stick stuck. Where's the talkie person? Am I just that blind right now? Oh shit, I fell in the hole. upset at my ability inability to find this construct oh there it is Ice 
fire, or is that a slate, and balloons? What parts? Where? Over here? Thanks for the torches. Do you just like the big pose just respawn here? Oh my god, they really do. Bridge! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> So many mines, so little time, and I've spent two hours in the depths. <laughs> oh, goodness. They really said, you don't get a boat. Only one-way boat. Bolt boat. Shocking. I've been here before and didn't see the the treasure back here. I think those are all the mines that I've found thus far. And now it's time to go back to Lookout Landing. Let me get some new battery. And then I'll go talk to my girl, Jasha. 
tell her that I met a new friend and I got some weird power with like three hands. What is Hestu doing here? Shalaka! Was he here the whole time and I just did not see and or notice? Oh my god. I just doubled my battery size. New capacity acquired. Wow. <laughs> it's cold, huh? Oh, uh, hi there. I was captivated by the sight of the ruins glistening in the rain. These ruins are very unusual. They're unique among all the ruins our survey team has discovered, on the surface at least. But we need to investigate it fully, but most of the team is at Ring Ruins. They're very important after all. I've already been there, sir. You see that giant donut nestled between these hills? The leader's hot, by the way. Is that Bronzagong? Bronzagong? Yeah, it is. Hmm? Swordsman, is it you? You look very pleased with yourself. Yeah, I got very lost. Could it be? Auto build with the ability to instantly replicate things you've built in schema stone. So there really was a Zonai temple housing mysterious power into the depths. Mm -hmm. Well, that also might mean some of the things collected from the depths may give us other clues. Wait here, just a second. Mm, not that. Nope, not that either. Ah, here we go. <laughs> here, swordsman. Hot air balloon. Uh -huh. I've been building things by hand for like 50 hours. I'm thinking we could recreate a balloon. Uh, you want me to fix it with auto build with the zonite I don't have? Okay. Swordsman, everything's ready. Please demonstrate how to build things. Yeah, I will, but I'm going to talk to Hestu. I need him to dance for me. Yeah. It's you, we meet again. It's been a while, huh? So this place was built recently, huh? It's got a good vibe, and I figure it's safe since there are lots of people here. There are so many monsters all over these days, so I'm going to stay here and relax for a while. Oh, hang on a minute. Do you have a Korok seed? You got Korok seed from one of the forest children? Ah, uh, expand a banda, bitch. Oh, we are watching the full animation. Believe you me.
It went from one, two, three to five. Are you serious, Hestu? Oh, look, I just want a full grow because I'm anal. Is the next one going to be what, 11 or 13? You know how many Koroks I haven't, I've like abandoned and, and left them to never be reunited with their friends? Many. I missed, I said 11 and 13, it was unfortunately 12. bubbles this time around for shield day it doesn't remember my last chosen Expanding the shield stash is a different rate from expanding the weapon stash. I haven't done much in terms of shrines today, have I? So weird. But I guess they have bows and arrows in the same thing. I had 80 seeds. <laughs> No, this is really quite exhilarating content.
Almost there, just one more animation to go. We did it, Joe. We made it. Congrats. Fifteen slots in total. Apples, wheat. All right, you want to see this thing go? Bonk. I... I can't believe it! You rebuilt the balloon in an instant! This mysterious power goes beyond scientific explanation. Goggles! Goggles! And what are you yelling about, Joshua? Uh, inconceivable! My balloon is fixed! This must be the mysterious power of the zone I had. I never thought I'd see such a marvel with my very own eyes. Thank you for making this a reality. Please take this. I've been saving it for a special occasion. I haven't been able to figure out what that is, but judging from that light, it's got to be Zonai in origin. And since you can use Zonai powers, I think it would be better for you to have it. There was an incredible power lying hidden in the depths after all. I think I'll keep researching the depths going forward. Who knows? I just might find a clue about Princess Zelda. If you make any new discoveries in the depths, please let me know, swordsman. Um, yes? Did you need something, swordsman? Hey. No way! Koga, the leader of the Yiga clan, was there? Oh, this is dangerous. Gotta regain my composure. Okay, come this way. Who knew that that hole that we subjected Master Koga to in Breath of the Wild ended him up in the depths. Some nice story continuity there. From what I know... Oh, so you faced Koga in the depths, huh? What's the leader of the Yiga clan up to down there? From what I know, the Yiga clan is a super dangerous group that schemes against the kingdom of Hyrule. And Koga has had it out for you and Princess Zelda for a long time. He'd do anything to put an end to your lives. Despite everything we're looking into already, we can't just take our eyes off this threat. Besides, Koga could know what's happened to the princess, and that would make a lot of sense. So if you do go after him, keep in mind that I'll be continuing my research of the depths from right here. By the way, do you know about the Forest of Time south of Hyrule Field? There's a chasm there, and I've gotten reports of another series of statues found at the bottom of it. These statues are different from the one you showed me using the camera. They seem to point somewhere, too, and do come near where you got your auto-build ability. But they don't stop there. These statues lead farther southwest into the depths. Where they go is anyone's guess. Yeah, I got lost going that direction. But I bet there's a destination far beyond that building worth seeing. I'll keep gathering info about what's in the depths, so be sure to stop by and check with me sometimes. Robbie's gone. Robbie will be gone. I really appreciate you fixing up my balloon. Ultra thinks that auto build thing is pretty darn amazing. Hmm. I should have gotten. I should have a good think about all the practical uses of that someday. Oh, that reminds me. Hey, you, listen up. Now that Josh has solved the mystery of that slate, I can return to the Purapad Laboratory in Hateno. If you go there, I can make even more improvements to your Purapad, starting with the sensor. You'll find the lab in Hateno Village. Alright, see ya. Enjoy the rain. I've been wanting to unlock him for the longest time. And now I finally get to do it because I've my reading comprehension has improved.
Oh my god, his balloon is here. A rainy welcome to you. What a pleasant evening. Hey, you! The Purpad Laboratory is ready for us to do some great things together. First, let's get that sensor up and running. One and a two and a three and a four. This is what the UI used to look like in Breath of the Wild. Dunzo! Now the sensor will make a sign if there are shrines near you. Okay, that wraps up my chatting. Hmm. Try it out. The sensor reacts when you're moving towards a shrine. There's a shrine at the cave at the bottom of the hill, but the sensor isn't reacting to it whatsoever. What? You already found it? I'd expect nothing less from you. That sensor will still be invaluable. It's the product of my brilliance, after all. I expect nothing less from me. Well, I've told you what you need to know about that sensor, but I fear it's gone in out in one ear and out the other, so hang on a minute. The details look correct, and I'll post it right here. Very good. There you go, the operation instructions. Now you can review the sensor feature anytime you want, just read that poster. But I'm nowhere near done yet. I've created new features for that device while I was waiting for you. I whipped up some prototypes and these extra features you can get on your pad at any time. That is, with some help from you and getting some final data I need in order to activate them properly. Let's talk if you want those upgrades. Well, I'm here, aren't I? <laughs> Your pad is nowhere near its full capacity, and it'll be even better after I add some extra features. Those include the most essential one, the travel medallion feature. There's also Hero's Path mode, and finally, Sensor Plus. First, I need you to gather some test data, so let's get to work! Uh, travel. Medallion. Give me your pad. Go to my old lab, the ancient tech lab. It's where the prototype of the travel medallion feature is. I started work on it there. I go myself, but there's some dangerous trespassers that have made themselves home there. Go and fetch that. Hmm, where was that again? Here, here it is. Old school teleportation point. By old school, I mean 2017. These are all like DLC updates. Hero's Path mode is an outstanding addition if you do a lot of investigating. Truth is that the tracking feature installed on the Pro Pad. Brilliant system that lets you see the exact path you've taken, but I need to get data from 15 shrine locations from you. I've already done that. I've done, like, 40 shrines. <laughs> now give me a moment. You can save around 256 hours of... of gameplay path. You want to see what the shit I've been doing thus far? He puts it on his chalkboard. <laughs> Sensor Plus! Mm. Yeah, I already have five types of monsters. Unbelievable! You've already got all that data? Then I can install that sensor upgrade right away. Uh, can you also give me more space? Because I only can take 64 photos. Actually, I actually have a compendium of my own. That's my database. It's got everything you could possibly want to find details about. It's all there. Creatures, monsters, materials, equipment, and even different kinds of treasure. In short, a perfect collection of what you might have 
might one day achieve in your own. Yeah, I, I forget to take pictures of bosses because I'm not playing Metroid Prime. But even if I were playing Metroid Prime, I honestly forget. Here's everything you're missing. What about a boss pick? A hundred for these things. Okay, but where can I put like my finished... Their office is so incredibly messy. I, I guess my office kind of looks like this. Oh, cool. A ladder to nowhere. I think I've been here already. The lab in Akala. Might as well just go. Get the travel medallion. Call it a day. Press X. Uh, I can record that at a later time. As for this, I should go find a stable? Nah, I can just float. I know there's an Akala stable somewhere. God, it's 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 easing me. The shrine that I just didn't get. A couple shrines that I haven't gotten. Oh my god, please game. Do not tease me. Oh, the stable's right there. Going to the stable. Oh, hello, shrine. I think that's the last spring. That's gotta be... A Korok.
Look, there's a pirate ship over here. There's a couple, three. There's so much out here that I just <laughs> haven't done. <sighs> I was in the depths all day. And there's a great fairy over here. Of course, there's a fairy. Yeah, I see it. You don't you don't have to buzz at me. Let's get wings out here. Hello, my blue horsey friend. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah. Ah. Oh. Oh. Did you meet Milena at Bloodleaf Lake to the north? If he takes a liking to you, you can boast your horse's ability or even bring your friend back to life. <laughs> So that's where they've moved her. Did I just forget about the well? Oh my god, I have so many others. Like... Things I could... Possibly get down here. Oh yes, miss. Damn it, I was too loud. Dude, look at the the light it 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 gives off. Anyways, come over here, my fairy. Nope. Oh wait, I I thought this was like I had to to swim in it. That's why I didn't go in it. I thought it was deeper. Turns out it was shallow. You also have Sage's Will. For four Sage's Will, I make your bond stronger. Why no give me heart? Thank you.
I didn't talk to everybody here. Oh no, there's a Korok here. Strongest in the world. Mm, that's an unusual weapon you have there. Where'd you get it? I made it. No kidding, I make weapons too. I've been using all sorts of materials trying to make the strongest weapon in the world. You ever heard of a monster they call Lionel? It's a huge beast with a body like a horse. You wouldn't believe how many times I've seen someone try to ride on a Lionel's back only to go flying. I actually spotted one of their kind near the northwest of here. To the entrance of Tempest Gulch, but I wasn't trying to pick a fight with a monster like that. Strong, agile, can snipe me from miles away, and did you mention they can shoot fireballs? Best I could do was turn tail before it caught sight of me. If only I could get a hold of that Lionel's horn, I can make the strongest weapon in the world, but I'm no fool. I haven't got the skill to take down a Lionel. I just wish that someone else would make the weapon of my dreams and show it to me. I'd give them a nice reward. Ho! Oh! Oh, my friend and I got separated. Oh, your friend is too far away. Hey, welcome to East Akala Stable, stomping grounds of the horse god. You got a problem with the horse? You're better off talking to Melania. Melania. The god of horses is about it, not to me. Oh. Take the road behind the stable to reach him without getting lost. Mm. I thought Melania was a dude, uh, a lady. You got buns? Yes, I, oh. I could use buns. Crispy on the outside, soft on the inside might give you a little luck. Best of all, it can be yours oh. for 10. I'll eat mm. it now. I have to follow a procedure to eat. Close your eyes, imagine the god of horses, then open wide and stuff it in. Mm. With the bun in your mouth, turn towards the god of horses, pondering his awesome power, and then chew. But keep your mouth closed and swallow it before it dissolves. Oh. So what do you think? Oh, it gave me a whole ring of stamina. Oh. It's only a matter of time. Just how long are they going to stay here? It may have spotted us spying on them from up the cliff. What if... should I do? If they come all the way up here? Mm? I'm sorry I didn't see you there. I've been preoccupied with the monsters that settled on the North Akala beach below the cliff. Keep thinking about what would happen if they came up to the stable. Can't even focus uh. on my work. I've been trying to find someone to go drive them up, but everyone I've asked have refused to help. Seems that skill and confidence are in short supply. Anyways, you see that big tree over there? Ah. If you look down from the cliff, you can probably see the monsters. It's intimidating, to be sure. Mm. Everyone keeps saying not to worry. I don't think I'll be able to relax until those monsters are gone for good! <laughs> Please eat. Let's see, what's in this issue? Uh. Rice, beef, and salt. Wow. Hi, Beetle. Sa, sa. You've never heard of Papalo Vulcensis? It's what you call a smother wing when you're doing science with it. But smother wing butterfly is a lot easier to say. Glad I could help! Wow! As a thank you for your business, I've got some words of wisdom for you. Did you know some folks think bugs are scary? That's natural. Okay, thanks Beetle. I thought you were gonna give me clothes or something, not like, give me a lecture. Hi, horsey. Huh. Huh. Where to next? Good evening, are you out on an adventure? I'm not just on a journey across the land, but a journey through time. I'm trying to get 
my eyes and all the old stuff I can. I wanted to see if they had anything like that at the Akala Ancient Tech Lab, but it seems like some weirdos took over, and I'm pretty much at a standstill, so... You like ancient things? Ancient things? You know, ancient things. Things that are ancient. Just look... One look at them, and it's like I've been transported through time. That's the thrill I'm looking for, but what should I go see next? Oh, I've got it. Did you hear they found giant fossils of leviathans that once lived in this land? It's true. How many? Not one, but two, but three giant fossils, which... Maybe I'll go introduce myself to the itty-bitty leviathan in Elden to start. Here. Let me do your map for a second. Oh, I can only imagine what he looks like, how beautiful he must be. Why don't you pay him a visit as well? I'm sure he'll set your heart afluttered. Too keyed up to stand around here. I'll go make my dreams. Reality. Horse, read the sign. <laughs> Stay back! <laughs> I'm a horse. <laughs> I can't read that sign. I can't read that sign because I can't read. Horse, will you be in the cutscene? Nope. The courage to pluck. To get what? Are you serious? It's a Jenga puzzle? What? You can't stand on it. Uh, oh my god, are you kidding me? I hope that's the treasure piece. It in fact was not the treasure piece. Oops. 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 <sighs> Oops. <laughs> what is going on, Nintendo? Please. Am I allowed to just stick everything together?
Except when I grab it, it moves immediately. Oh no! Well, shit. You know what? <laughs> um. Oh my god. Come over here, please. Come grab this over here. Oh, I can't grab it? Rude. Open. Okay, do you have to run up here? <laughs> I don't under I don't really know what this platform does. Is it gonna come back? Okay. All this just for a ball.
I was gonna ask how I hurt myself. It's because I tried to jump onto that the Jenga tower, and it said, "No, you're not allowed to be on here. Enjoy hell." Enjoy the rain. It's a tree. Hey, bro. Look out for what? It's a horse. Oh, shit. Moblin guts. I'm on a slope. Oh, did you not like it? Why is it trying to pin itself there? Like, no. Is that good enough? <sighs> like some of the ways that it wants me to, to pinch are are very dumb in my opinion. <laughs> but it's it's something. All right, Addison, let go. Somehow, he's standing. Uh. Uh. 
yeah, I haven't done one of these sign things in a while, haven't ah! I? <laughs> Can't wait for some mushroom balls. Where's my horse? Why is my horse over here? Suspicious. Yep. Time to kill him. Dead. Stay away from my horse. <laughs> I hit a bird with my horse. Let's see what they're doing here. What happened here? The lantern. Maybe I'll put some bananas down, huh? I've missed. You know what? Yaha! -ha. <laughs> Nearby down below, it actually tells me how it's very interesting. That it's telling me up or down. That wasn't the case before. <laughs> Very shit. Guess we'll have to burn it. Oh shit. I've set everything on fire. I'm a menace. All oh, because I wanted to set it on fire. Mostly because that sword just didn't work. Dude is really just chilling up here, huh? What does this say?
What do I have on that once? Thought you could sneak past us, didn't you? Come out front and let's settle this. <laughs> Daddies. The dads are here, and my horse is here too. <laughs> well, shit. I'll give those miserable sheik uh, one thing. They made us a decent laboratory. <laughs> what did they think was going to happen after leaving it alone for so long? We've taken over this place. Now it's Yiga Clan's Akala branch. They left some parts and materials lying around here too. Might be useful, so send them to the hideout's research team right away. Right away? How right away are we talking here? I mean, we're in Akala, northeast of Hyrule, and the Hyrule is all the way in the southwest of Gerudo, since it's on the completely opposite side of the map. I get a feeling that we might take a while. Mm. Stow the complaints. The role of the branches is to provide intel and supplies to the hideout labs and our bases in the depths. Anything we think is useful goes to the hideout. That's the ironclad rule. My apologies, I'll pass those supplies along as quickly as I can. Will it stay on fire? I don't understand how it's staying on fire. Why can't we just settle it and smash, huh? Um, what the fuck, bro? Shocked myself. <laughs> uh, the rain makes these things look so much bigger. Like there's a banana looking thing in the map. How cute is that? Oops, sorry, horse. Yeah. 
flame. Oh, he's about to get electrocuted. Oh, shit. <laughs> I put a banana and killed him. Stay away from that. And then go collect my banana. This is ridiculous. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I'll make your little uniforms without any more complaints, I swear. Hold up. Hey, hey, superstar, you're not with the Yuga clan, are you? Please tell me you're here to rescue me. That's, that's fantastic. I've been cooped up in here forever. The name's Kanba. I got a knack for style and the nimble digits I need to spin my ideas into reality. Alas, that pure talent is why the Yiga clan kidnapped me and forced me to make their outfits for them. If I ever sew one of those tacky rags again, it'll be too soon. In fact, you should just take the Yiga armor I finished. Burn it, toss it, do whatever you want, but just get it away from me. The look may lack, but my tailoring is sublime. If you wore the whole set, you'd fit right in with the Yuga clan. On that note, I gotta hurry out of here before they get back. Don't worry, I'm more athletic than I look. Uh, they only caught me last time because I messed up and it won't happen again. See you around and thanks for the save. Bye, stick. A torch mop. See a book here. Read the diary from down here. I designed the perp pad to be capable of various experiments in hopes of carrying some of the burden for Hyrule's recovery. Robbie built a prototype right away, and we asked the princess to use it in her work across Hyrule. Princess Zelda learned quickly and was quite delighted to capture test pictures with the camera. The camera was intended for use in investigations, but it is possible it could also be useful in everyday life. Perhaps after the recovery, a time will come when everyone has their very own parapad. <laughs> Just imagine. I've decided where to hide the second volume. For the last two spots, maybe I'll shoot arrows at a map. Update. Genius doesn't translate to being good with a bow. I ended up piercing the floor instead of the map. Are these the Yiga clan locations? No. Need to use the camera. Ah, album is full. I can select a whole bunch. Yeah. They have a hideout on the plateau, they have a hideout way up here, and they have their hideout in that spot. Travel medallion prototype. Hup. 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 
Oh no, the mop stick broke. Oh, everything broke. What pain. Please. No. Thank you. All right, let's go see Robbie. Where's Robbie? Do I detect the unmistakable odor of my old home on you? What, then you already have it? Then that'll do the trick. Hurry up and let me see it. Write that to your key item so you never lose the ability to lose it. Two more gates. <laughs> and map locations. Oh. Ah. <laughs> what? You've already got the data? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I'm insane. Fifteen map data locations. I need fifteen map data locations. So I guess I haven't done that. Wow, the door's just fucking closed on me. Rude. I could use some story time, couldn't I? Or I could go and get this little shrine thing. Go to the Yiga hideout on the plateau, I could. It's just the two on one that I'm not really great at. I don't like being gang bang. Link, why are you cold? Don't be cold. Where am I trying to go? Over there. Grab it! Grab it! It worked. Is it because it's nighttime I'm cold?
Oh my god. There she is, nestled. that sound? Oh, a like-like. Rgok Shrine. Force transfer. Like, what does it want me to do? I gotta pee. Still don't understand what all of this is for. All of that to get a stick? For what? Here, put a banana on it. Okay, what's so special about this? Why can't I climb on this? 
Being able to climb on that is weird. Okay. I... Oh, 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 Link. Almost took it up there. I'm really trying to get it to stick there. But I might have to do it one at a time. Oopsies. Oh, that's still not enough? What was this thing? You know what, let me just take this back. Or not. Christ. Thanks for the stick. <laughs> I, I'm just gonna yank it off after I get up here. Once they told me I could climb on this, I was like, it's over for you bitches. <laughs> I'm not gonna put it on the fucking gear. No ma'am. They had intended a specific way for me to do that, and I was like, nah, that, that's not happening here.
God. God, I've missed. I need it, it needed to go away. Oh, there's a great fairy over here. Link, please. And a stable I haven't been to. Oh, please stop! Go open the thing! I wonder if there are any other shrines on the plateau. Oh no. The stakes guide you. Oh god. Wow, I can reposition the stakes. I've never really used the stakes in this game. And now I know. I could have just used this to get that treasure, couldn't I have? Do I have to build a, f a pinball thing? Bonk. I know what I have to do. My brain just hurts. I 
and it just f keeps forcing me out. Oops. Not really where I wanted to place it, but I have to live with my decision. No? Is it too high? I don't know what that's going to do. Oh god. You know what? Let's just make this thing go backwards, shall we? Oh, that sound sounds so weird when it goes inside the thing. Did it just bounce off? Will this make it stay? Oh. Okay, where's that paddle? Hi. You know, now that it's down here, I probably don't need it. <gasps> Come back, please. Oh no! Why did it not go in? Oh, that sound is so gross. <sighs> Weird. Very different from all the other ones I've done.
Hi, frogs. I don't have anything that can break these. I need a a handy rock. No rock. I mean, would it work with luminous stone on it? Or will it just break? Diamond, luminous stone. It's kind of trash. Not an easy to find Korok, by the way. Have an apple, buddy. Welcome, uh -huh. Outskirt Stable. Ah. Have you ever seen the ruins at Dig Dog Bridge? You can get there by heading west down the road to a three-way intersection, then going south. The biggest in the world. Ah. Looks like a pie, sugar cane, wheat. Butter, egg. Ah. Eh. Mm. Mm. Ah. What did she say? Nearby woodland stables in a panic. Those are all the trees located in the, the whole map. Hi. Hello, welcome. Come with the great fairy Kaisa. The great fairy grants travelers a blessing. <laughs> she sealed herself away. Oh. Why, when the flutist piper came by, she would poke her face out of the fountain. It's been a long time. She loved that music group that used to pass through. I wish they would oh. play for her. Where is she? Ah, oh, you startled me. Um, this is Outskirt Stable, and welcome. So sorry, I have something on my mind. When you came up, you panicked. Oh, sorry. What are you gonna say? The stage is where the tr stable trotters used to perform. They've been on a break. Sounds like there was some sort of trouble. 
Yeah, I've seen them up there, but they haven't said anything to me. Do I have to fix someone's car for them? Need something? Oh. Birthplace of Hyrule. Blocked by a high ah. cliff. Couple chasms up there, for sure. Mm. Mm. Finally managed to leave Gerudo Town and set off on our search for Vo. I wanted to put all our Vo and you lessons to the test, but none of the Vo have matched ah. up. Are measured up. That reminds me, before we left, I heard someone talking about a Vo and the hero. Outside world, they called him a hero. Huh? Bet he's a strong Vo. Who's even taller than us. I'm gonna take him out! You mean ask him out, right? Our class did cover how to be the one to make the first move. Anyway, I'm sure it's possible to pursue the hero, but how would we even recognize him? Oh yeah, the legendary sword, and I remember. Legendary sword. Wait, what is that sword? If it's good enough to be called legendary, then it probably glows or something? Maybe it's really tall, taller than us if we were standing on each other's sh shoulders. Mm. Sounds like a real play pain. It's just easier to launch a surprise attack. If we were very careful, we could easily sneak up on the target. We have to stop referring to those as targets. Okay, buddy, where's your friend? Bro. Really? All the way up there? I've gone into my reserves that I paid 10 rupees for. Take a rest, Link. I'm waiting here for my friend. My friend's over that way. I wonder what happened. Well, let's see. Can... I'm gonna toss a coconut down there. Oh, please. Coconut, please. Go. Go, my friend. Ride with the coconut. Oh, shit. He fell off. The coconut rolled. Did I take too long? <gasps> ah! Please? Picking a round object was not the move. Please stay on the fruit. Oh my god. Oh no! Oh 
Uh, this didn't work out as planned. It ran out of memory. Well. Oh, no. Sorry, Korok. You're good as dead. I've been distracted. <laughs> oh god. How's it- how, how long is it gonna take me to get this Korok up the fucking mountain, eh? Cool. 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 Oops. Oh my god, he's still stuck to the coconut! Well, how am I gonna put it out? I don't have anything to put it out with. Oh, this. Or this. <laughs> At some point, yeah, I need to take it off. Make sure the Korok doesn't fall off. Thanks for the palm fruit. You're here. Goodbye, balloon. Bye-bye, balloon. What is this music?
Why is there music like this? There's a gore on here. Yeah. Hey, I made myself quite the tower, eh? Just look at that. Oh. And I put that bell right on top of it. My, my air balloon is in the background. Why you ask? Because I thought of a new game. I test the strength. Want to give it a go? Oh. Yep. Your goal is to make the bell at the top of this tower ring as loud as you can. Throw something at it with as much force as you can. Do that, and the bell will answer. Oh. You're welcome to all the stuff over there. Some of it's left over from when I built the tower. Some of this weird junk I don't really know what to do with anyways. Oh. Once you ring the bell, the game ends, and you only get one ring per round. Also, I built this thing on my own, and the parts ain't cheap, so I gotta charge you a fee. 30 rupees per try. These stakes are so weird. Oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Um. Um. Oops. Guess I don't really know how to use those, eh? I don't know how to make it separate from the spring thing. Oh. Bye bye. Uh oh. We had liftoff, but a uh, failure to launch. Maybe this will hold the big boulder so I don't have to attach it. Yeah, I've wasted 30 rupees. Ha! 
Oh god. Uh, what a waste of money. From this metal boulder. I'll send up one rock. A singular rock. That must have been 23 on the Mega Ding scale. You did okay, but you can do better. The trick to really ring it is to throw something real heavy real fast. Now show me what you got. Uh, uh, sure. Spring. This is not going to work. Yeah, I need to stake it into the ground a little bit. I don't know how to use the time bomb super well. Oh, 
Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> I have no fucking clue what I'm building here. It's really just vibes. It's like hodgepodgey, whatever. Is necessary to get the job done. Oh, please. My log came off. It gave me a piece of wood. Oh, <sighs> rocket, please. Okay, good. Finally! <laughs> Thought that was a monster roaring, that bell sure is loud. That must have been a 78 on the Megading scale. So loud, I love it. I could sit here all day listening to you do that. Oh, that's it? Oh, no, 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 no! Is it time for me to die? Oh my god, what is this? Hi. I'm gonna die. Oh, fuck me. Nope, we're not doing this. I don't know what's going on. Oh, it flies? It has individual heads? Sister. Sister. Sister! <laughs> I need a rubber suit. I need a rubber suit. I need a rubber suit. I don't have a rubber suit. We're not doing this, girl. Oof.
turn back. Oh shit, are you fucking kidding me? Keep going, girl. You in danger. Is she gonna fly up here and come for me? Oh, now it's raining? Even better. Look at her. She's like, ah, okay. Yeah, we're not doing that. Let me check what holes I've been into. I've been in that hole. Been in that hole, been in that hole. No, I haven't been in one of these holes. See, this hole is not marked. This hole, not marked either. In going in holes. I didn't even realize this was an underground shrine. <laughs> Remnants of Magnesis. Great Plateau North Chasm. I just wanted to unlock it. I at least get it out on my map. Will I at least break this? It's not breaking it. I don't know the fastest way to get there. <sighs> uh, you know, I should check out where the old Shrine of Resurrection was. Just to see if they put anything interesting there. Oh my god, I need to eat. Uh, I'm crazy.
Shrine of Resurrection is here. I believe. If it's not there, then it's here. I think it's the, the pink, the purple one. I haven't been up here? Uh oh. Well, time to be distracted some more. I mean, look, that thing still has the thing on top of it. I have to, at a minimum, do that. See, like, this goes quickly. Why can't the the menu that has me attach thing and throw things to... <laughs> to arrows not work, huh? A reflective device, I have to use mirrors. Huh? Is it a mirror or is it a prism? Or can I just hold it? When do I have to do more than one light bounce, huh? Is that now? I guess it is now. They're gonna make light a central... thing in this game, aren't they?
Now, child, the fuck is this? Where's me treasure at? Oops. Oh my god. I was going to use that block, but I, it's not happening. And, and now how is that staying like that? Mirror Club? <laughs> I don't understand when it works. It's kind of awkward, to say the least. The mirror stuff is weird.
I mean, I could put on pants. Boing. Oh, fuck me. I've been in that hole. Shrine of Resurrection is where I'm trying to go. It's a bloopy there. <laughs> they tried to make it hard to see. Oh, come on, game. Shrine of Resurrection. Yep, that's still the same. Hi, friend. Oh, wow. You got hide out? When the glow of the blood-stained moon shines upon the land. Huh. There's a construct here. Single banana. Danger. It won't talk to me.
Ah, uh, so you knew it was a trap. You stumbled into our secret storehouse for treasures from the depths, and now you've seen it. I can't let you live. Your life is mine. Goodbye. <laughs> Thanks for the bananas. Thank you for driving away the intruders. These interlopers carried me here with them from the depths. I have no way of returning to where I was stationed there. I would therefore continue my work here. My task in the depths was to manage schema stones. A great deal of zonite was mined and processed there once. Beam cycle. Okay, but how am I supposed to find said shrine from here, huh? It doesn't say it's above or beneath me. Oh. It is above me. Oh no, this is where I came in from. This healed me. So where could the shrine be? Okay, it's not beeping anymore. Up, down. Oh, it is hot water. Anything will look breakable. Burnable, breakable. Is it outside? Wait, why does it say, why does it say burn? Oh my god. Just a little itty bitty treasure. I don't see a shrine up here, but it beeps as if there were. I need to put on pants.
Why did it stop beeping? Is that a cave? Oh my god, it's a cave. It says it's nearby, it doesn't say it's abo above or below. Why is this dude here? Getting murked by a torch. Blade blade. The buzzes are back.
Was it like inside this thing the whole time? A path behind... River of the Dead Waterfall Cave. This is the thing that's been blinking at me this whole time. Oops. They really hid some of these shrines, my god. Fire and water. Was I not supposed to do it like that? <laughs> Big sad. Come here, block some fire for me, will ya? It's not going to give me new ice until this melts. Did this thing shrink on me? Because I fucked up. This game really likes to let... Stuff like that happen, huh? Oh, was I supposed to just grab this and bring it over? My bad. You know what? You can just go into the fire over here. How about that? Enjoy. Wait, what?
I forgot ice is made out of water. <laughs> and then it tips. I think it's just a smaller block. Am I supposed to electrify that? I must be getting some kind of order of operations wrong. Let's <laughs> go. 
Oh, one of these is metal, one of these is not. What in the world? Maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe I can just go up. What a fucking waste. That's all I was trying to do. Shit, man. How frustrating. Love wasting a fairy. Yeah, ha ha. Damn it. Yeah, ha. Oh, no, you better. Nope, not really. This is a very narrow hole. Oh, 
At least now we know where all the holes go. That's where I'd like to be. Let me travel here. And get out. And see if I can kill those people in that little outhouse. Well, I can still walk up it. I need this. <laughs> can I put a banana through there? Peace offering. Huh? 
Who's there? Wait, you? Your Link thought you'd ambush us, did you? Well, you're the one getting ambushed today. Oh no, my bananas are being singed. None of them wanted my bananas I left out here. You know how sad that makes me? Very sad. Let me go! I'm working as fast as I can. Please, just give me a little more time. Wait, you're not one of them. You chased off the Yiga clan, you mean... I can get out of here? Hurrah. Those Yiga guys were forcing me to make weird outfits for them. It was awful. Why me? Your guess is as good as mine. Maybe because of my reputation for flashy fashion. I only let CC brand threads touch this body. I don't want this mask I made fall into their hands, but I can't bring it with me. Say, would you want to take this? I think it's decidedly not my style, but it's yours. Uh, more powerful to- more power to you. I'm actually dressed like this so that I can confess my feelings to the woman who stole my heart. Her name is Nobo. She's beautiful with a fashion sense that rivals my own. She's probably at a stable somewhere, I think. Oh. Maybe. And anyway, we're meant to be, so I know that my fate will guide her. Take care now. I hope you find someone and love her too. No. Yiga Bulletin Confidential Updates from the Hideout Item 1, our research division has developed new vehicles, the Gloom Dredger and the Hover Doom MK3. If one of these vehicles is damaged, please contact a member of the research division in the depths right away. Item 2, it is imperative that all espionage agents in the field learn the Earthquake Technique. Addendum, the Earthquake Technique can only be learned at the Hideout's training area. So I've gotten that one, and I need to get that one, north of the castle. Look, at least I can make my way out. There's really this one that I just didn't get. In Hyrule Field. A shrine. Yep. The thing is blinking saying I didn't get it. Yep, there it is. How shall I help you, Addison? Oh, 
Uh, do I have to put stakes in? This is not my greatest work, but it stayed up. I need to do the shrine and I'll be done for the day. Oh, I didn't know there was a fucking chasm right there. Oh my god, not a fucking again.
How do I make it rotate? I don't understand. What does this do? Oh. Get fucked. Get got. <laughs> Now, what is this? jump off of the thing and then uh, I don't see the edge because it blends in. I feel like I'm playing baseball. Angle, I guess.
<laughs> Bye. Nope. <gasps> Daniel! Okay, it's... Oh, shit. <laughs> it worked for a second. Alright. It really doesn't want me to do that, huh? <laughs> oh, that one piece that I needed is gone. Got it! Let's go! Look what I can't take with me! Turns out I can't take it with me. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. That does it for me tonight. I hope you enjoyed your stay. As for me, I'm going to go make some dinner. Bye.